In this short video, we'll explain what EXIF data is and how to use our EXIF viewer to read it. EXIF data, or metadata, is information stored in your photo. This data includes a variety of information, such as the model of the camera and lens, aperture, shutter speed, and ISO. It also includes information about camera settings, such as the lens focal length and when the shot was taken. If your camera has GPS, you will also have location information about where the photo was taken. There can be a lot of other information as well in your EXIF data, but these are the main ones that you'll probably be most interested in. The EXIF data is how programs like Lightroom and Photoshop can show you your settings. The word EXIF is an abbreviation for the Exchangeable Image File Format Standard. Being able to look at the EXIF data of images on the web can be very useful for seeing how someone took a photo and also what gear they used. Images don't always contain EXIF data. Sometimes photographers choose to remove the EXIF metadata before sharing their photos, and sometimes sites that photos are uploaded to remove the EXIF data. So, to recap, EXIF data is most of the camera settings and information at the time you took the photo. You don't always want to open image editing software to browse a photo's EXIF data, you just want a quick way to view the metadata. This is especially true if you're just browsing online and find a photo that you're interested in seeing how it was taken. The EXIF viewer from Lenong Data lets you view the metadata from images, either on your device or from a URL. You can use our EXIF viewer by visiting the EXIF viewer page on our website. You can also install our browser extension, which gives you the same features as the web page, but also adds the ability to right-click an image on a web page to view as metadata in a browser tab. Okay. Let's take a look at the viewer. The EXIF viewer lets you select an image from your device or from a web URL. Clicking this button will open the file browser on your device. I'm using a desktop computer here, but this will also work on your mobile phone. Let's select an image. The viewer will open the image and display the EXIF data. You can see here the camera make, lens focal length, shutter speed, aperture, and ISO speed. Clicking the image will enlarge the image. Scrolling down, we can see various other pieces of metadata, such as the date the image was created, modified, which software was used to edit the image, and the lens model. Some images have more metadata available, some have less. This image, for example, has Sony-specific metadata, and we show this highlighted in blue. If your image has location information embedded, we can use that to show a map of where the photo was taken. Here's an example. You can see this photo was shot in Arezzo, in Italy. You can, of course, zoom into Street View to see the location more precisely. To view an image on the web, use this box to type or paste in a URL. I've previously viewed some images, so I can select one of those from the history here. Let's wait until the image loads. As you can see, this is the same information that we would see when viewing an image on our device. Copying and pasting URLs is a bit slow for most of us, but luckily we have an easier way. You can use our EXIF Viewer Browser extension to select images on a web page. Let's try the extension. Once it's installed, it adds an icon to your toolbar, like this. Simply select this icon, and you'll be able to use the extension just like the web page. You can select images on your device or enter URLs. Let's select an image. OK, now I'm going to try the extension on the Unsplash website. We'll select an image from their home page. Right click on the image and then choose the View EXIF Info option. This will open a new browser tab and load the image. Let's wait until the image loads.
Now we can see the images EXIF data. I hope that's helped with understanding how to view EXIF data with our tools. Don't forget to subscribe and like our video.